The fast food chicken restaurant has a failing grade. Nearly half a dozen critical violations were checked off. The grade is a 63 at Bojangles. The one on West Emory Road in Powell, that 63 is a failing score. A grade of 69 and below is considered failing. The inspector returned for a follow-up in that passing grade in just a moment. First off, the inspector found hair in palmetto cheese. The cheese was thrown away. The inspector observed no one washing their hands during the inspection. He writes, when employees clocked in and went to work, they didn't wash their hands. When they changed gloves, they didn't wash their hands, which they're required to do. Perhaps they didn't wash up because there was no soap in the hand sink. The manager filled it up when the inspector brought it to his attention. There's more. Clean dishes that had been put away had food debris stuck to them. The inspector watched a kitchen worker eating while preparing food. Can't do that. Finally, the inspector writes there was no managerial control in place at the restaurant. It was suggested the management staff attend the county's free food safety classes. Now there's been a follow-up inspection at Bojangles and Powell. All of the original critical violations were checked and corrected, and the new re-inspected grade is a 90. No need for any second inspections at the top scoring restaurants, and here are the best grades of the week. Ola's Southern Cuisine 2 in South Knoxville on Chapman Highway 100. The Maui Wowie Cafe on East Broadway in the North City scores 100. In Crossville, the Creekside Brewing Company on Highway 127 South is also perfect. McAllister's Deli, the one on Morrell Road in Knoxville, receives a 99. The famous Big Ed's Pizza in Oak Ridge scores a 99. Same grade, 99 at the Double C Grill on Highway 30 in Athens. In Harriman, the Six Blessings Cafe on Roan Street also receives a 99. And Hit the Spot Pizza on Alberta Street in Oneida scores a 98. This week, there were quite a few restaurants with scores in the mid to upper 90s, and those grades mean that management and staff have their act together by knowing and following the health rules. Don Dare covering Food for Thought. If you would like to look over all this week's health inspection scores for yourself, we're trying to make it as easy as possible. Yeah, they're all under the news tab on our website, wate.com, or you see the QR code there. You can scan it, and it'll take you right to the page.